Hello again, this is Roberto Matthews with another quick tip. I'm working on my projects. Um, I have a lot of audio that I have to fix for people. And one of the things, one of the main problems that I always have is that somebody has given me a uh, video with the audio that has been recorded incorrectly and I need to be able to fix that. So um, what I've done is I'm opening up my, um, my Adobe Premiere here and as you can see, when I drag this movie in here, I have a stereo track, but you can plainly see that the stereo has been recorded only to one track. I don't want that, obviously, because that's not going to be conducive at all. It's just going to come out of one speaker. So perhaps the person had a mono um, speaker or some, something happened with them, but um, in any regard, I have to fix this. So I can go into here and do some sort of convoluted thing where I have to, you know, um, edit with the sound booth and try to render it and, and um, you know, all kinds of things that would make it a little bit difficult. Um, it might work for something that's only a minute or two minutes long, but as you can see, this thing is over an hour long. So um, that takes a long time and I really can't do that. So I found this little area here. I couldn't find it anywhere um, on YouTube, so that's why I'm making this. Um, it's a really simple tip. Basically, when you click before you enter it into your um, into your sequence here, what you want to do is you want to right click on your main audio or your main video rather, and click modify. Go to audio channels, and as you can see here, you have my left and my right channel. Now, in my case, my left channel is completely unusable. So I'm going to um, take away the left channel. What I want to do is uh, um, click on mono as stereo and uh, take my left out and have this mono come out, this mono channel come out as stereo. Okay? So what I'm going to do is, now I have two options. I can either do mono, um, and I'm going to show you that in a second. Now I'm going to mono as stereo. Press OK, and then drag it in. And as you can see, it took my right channel, my mono channel, and made it stereo. Let me go back, and let's say you only wanted it to be mono. I go back into my modify here, audio channel, and just switch this toggle to just mono. Like I said before, it's gonna basically it's gonna select your left for you again. Just unselect the, the channel you don't want, press OK, and now this time, now you have to be careful here because this is this channel that I set up on my um on my Adobe on my sequence is stereo so it's gonna automatically pick this one here that's the only mono one so as when I click here you'll see that it's only picking the mono um, channel so um, I, I don't want to do that because it's gonna mess up my sequence but as you can see it's only gonna pick whatever is mono here okay so let's gonna go once again let's go back to the modify audio channels and I want my mono channel to be as stereo. I'm unselecting the, the channel that I don't want and then I'm gonna press OK. Now when I drag it in, everything is working perfectly fine. So that's a little quick tip. I hope that will help you out, especially if you have a lot of projects to do. Thank you very much.